Hello, all. It's um, Taylor from Taytime. Um, we're gonna finally recap the Fear of the Walking Dead mid-season finale, cause you know, life got in the way. Um, it's been a while, so I've had some time to process this. Um, I actually have to look up the titles right now, cause I fail hard. Um, it was actually a really good mid-season uh, finale on The Unveiling and Children of Wrath. Um, basically, Ophelia's still alive. Uh, so is Strand. Don't, and he burned the Abigail down. So that either happened in The Unveiling or Children of Wrath. Which one? I don't remember. It's been so long. Um, turns out Ophelia actually poisoned the camp with anthrax. Ophelia, I'm disappointed in you. The only difference, though, between you and Eugene is you at least admitted you were wrong and you felt horrible. Eugene is still on a no-no. So, for those of you saying she's a new Eugene, remember, she still has some form of a moral compass. Um, but basically, in the end, Madison has to... Um, the agreement she worked out with Walker is that she has to kill and bring him the head of Jeremiah. And before she goes to do that, she ends up telling Nick, who got haircut, and Alicia that, um, when she was younger, back in Alabama, which <laughs> fits a theory that I've been meaning to post for a while, my bad, but, um, you guys will hear it soon, um, that she killed her alcoholic father one day when she was younger. This is going to get interesting, but then as she goes to kill Jeremiah, Nick bursts through the door and kills him. Well, that doesn't burst. He kind of just meanders in through the door and kills him for her. Gives her the head of Walker and everything. And now that the Comic-Con footage has been released, obviously we know Strand finds Madison, or Madison finds Strand, one of them. Um, don't know, uh, not Strand, Daniel. I don't know why I was thinking Strand. I'm a dumbass. Excuse me for that. I don't know why I was thinking Strand. It's Daniel. She finds Daniel. Um, clearly there's going to be some Ophelia Walker stuff. Um, clearly Nick and Troy are up to something, as is um, Jake. What? I don't know. I have a feeling that... What celebrity that was on the couch said that he thinks Jake's really the bad kid and Troy's not? I have a feeling that's actually going to come true. I have a feeling Troy's actually going to survive if he doesn't. Because they're like, a few people are like, ah, he's not going to live. He actually might. Which is weird. Um. I don't know what the good deal is going to be with the guy from Fame and the other Hispanic woman. But I'm really interested for this back half. Um. And I'm excited to see what you guys think. So. Let me know in the comments down below. We'll hopefully get this show on the road.